Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well and having a great Sunday. And if your Sunday isn't going great, hopefully I can cheer you up just a little bit because I do have another furniture update for you guys. And it's basically a continuation from the video where I shared with you guys an update to my small office area. And the major update was really showing you guys my absolutely beautiful new office chair but i did also show you guys that i made a mistake when i ordered that office chair and that mistake was basically not measuring the height of the armrests so when the chair arrived naturally i was super excited unboxed it tried to slot it underneath my antique desk and it did not fit so i was not particularly happy however Every cloud has a silver lining. The good news is I absolutely love the chair and I absolutely had no intention of sending it back, but I just can't use it for its intended purpose and therefore needed to find an alternative solution. And you might be able to see a little bit of a sneak peek of the solution on camera right now to my left. And the solution that I'm gonna share with you guys is one that I have had on my Pinterest board for about, I wanna say three to four years. So pre-renovation and didn't buy it um, until this particular instance because I wasn't really sure exactly how I would incorporate it into my interiors. My particular approach to interiors is much more focused on curating versus just buying pieces because I need them. I wanna make sure that every piece I buy isn't just a functional piece but kind of works with the look and feel and the aesthetics of my home and sometimes that takes a lot longer than I would like but I do also really enjoy that process so again this furniture piece has been on my Pinterest board for about four years and the moment to purchase it came because the original um, I suppose chair that I wanted to go into my small office area wasn't wasn't able to fit so the solution basically is this really really beautiful stool and it is a stool from cartel so cartel is a well-known furniture brand that are very well distributed on uh, furniture stores and sites like heels like i think they're, they're i think they're sold basically everywhere and it, this particular stool comes in lots of different colors and for me there are two options in terms of color that i had on my pinterest board the first one was the clear version, so it comes in a clear version and then the stone version which is this kind of dark um, grey slash black colour here. So on camera it might look like it's mirrored, it's not. It's uh, acrylic or lucite and has this really beautiful opaque detailing and also this diamond cut detailing that you hopefully should be able to see on screen. But I'm going to show you it in situ because when you see the stool in situ, guys, you're going to think that I had originally planned it to be there in the first place and had, you know, um, you know, uh, and the idea was always to have that stool instead of my office chair. And that absolutely, absolutely is not the case. It just ended up working so well uh, that I couldn't have planned it better myself. So again, you can find this stone stool pretty much on most furniture um, department stores. And it is a very, very modern piece. And when I was looking for a seating solution for my French antique desk, I actually wanted a more of a modern piece because I just think interiors becomes so much more interesting and so much more unique when you do mix um, decades or periods that don't really go together naturally. But when they do go together or curated together, it just creates an interesting uh, aesthetic symphony which I just find is so much fun uh, in terms of in terms of kind of finding those types of um, uh, pieces. So this is a modern piece that is going to go with my antique French desk. So without any further ado, I'm going to show you exactly what it looks like in situ. So guys, this is the seating solution that I have basically paired to go with my antique French desk and I absolutely love it guys. And you may be able to spot that the color of the stool perfectly matches the color of my Lucite chess set, which I've talked about previously, and I absolutely couldn't have matched this even if I tried, and I didn't plan to have these two together at all. It just, I, I actually didn't even realize they went together literally until I placed the stool underneath the um, antique desk. And yes, the materials are almost they are not that they are literally identical in color not even almost the color of the uh, chess set 
the black pieces there match the black piece or the black stool that you can see here or the color at least for cartel is called stone but it's almost like i planned it guys and i absolutely didn't and i don't know if the color is coming through on camera but it's just so beautiful how these two pieces basically complement each other so well so basically the idea is that if you want to play a game of chess or if i want to work here with my laptop I've got somewhere to sit on and also what's great about having a stool is that it's really good for posture um, so it's not only aesthetic but can actually help you improve your posture and I actually think my posture has improved really actually over the past I want to say a few months because um, I've been a lot more conscious of, of, of working on that but yes guys I want to show you how these two pieces complement each other so well and again I absolutely love the juxtaposition of the modern cartel stool and this clearly old antique um, desk that you can see here and yes this is currently what the um, seating solution is looking like I love it I absolutely love it and this area still needs a lot more love so stay tuned for additional decor pieces that I am going to bring into this space because it is by no means finished in any way shape or form but i'm just really really happy with the solution in fact i need to push it in a little bit because i do think it needs to be pushed in so i think that's probably where it will stay when not in use but yeah i'm really really pleased with this guys and in case you're wondering the stool was actually reasonably affordable it's about 180 pounds roughly um so it's not going to uh, hopefully break the bank but um yeah i thought i'd share that with with, with you guys because yeah it's very accessible comes in lots of different colors and i will link it below in case you are interested but yes that is it guys this is the other update the update or the solution that i found let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section do you think that there was a better solution have you found a better solution let me know guys i'm open to being um informed and inspired by you guys as well so thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video guys. Take care.